Hello friends and welcome back to the Latin. Today we will learn how to run open web UI on Mac OS with Docker. Step-by-step -step instructions for today's tutorial are available on the Table Rock Academy. Businesses seeking technical support, visit tablerockindustries.com. First up, we need to install Docker. Head over to docker.com and download the Mac OS version. After downloading, install Docker and add it to your applications. Next, open Docker, go through the setup wizard, and use the terminal to verify it's working using the command docker dash dash version. Now that we know Docker is properly installed, step two is to pull the open web UI image into Docker. To do so, enter the following docker pull command and wait a few minutes for everything to download. While you're waiting, make sure you subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss a future episode. Once the docker pull is complete, step three is to create an open web UI container. In a new terminal, I'll create a directory for open web UI data, and then use the following command to launch open web UI on Docker, which you can just copy and paste from the academy. You only need to do this once, so don't be intimidated. To access open web UI, head to localhost colon 8080 in your web browser. If it doesn't load right away, wait a minute as it might still be loading. A good indicator that it's still loading is a high CPU load in Docker. Once Open Web UI loads, create an account. The first account will be the admin. In a recent video, we added Olama to our Mac, and we can connect to it with Open Web UI. Go to the admin panel, settings, connections, and edit the Olama API. It looks like the API endpoint is already set, so we can test the connection, and it looks good. Let's head back over to the chat and ask Gemma3 a question. Tell me a fun fact about the Roman Empire. Okay, here's a fact about the Roman Empire. Romans actually used to decorate their amphitheaters with incredibly realistic and detailed mosaics, some of which are so vibrant they could be seen from space. Great. Now, if we want to use Open Web UI on other devices within the network, go to Terminal and use ipconfig to find our IP address. Then on another device, instead of using localhost, we'll enter the MAC IP address followed by colon 8080. Once we log in, we have full access to Open Web UI running on Docker with the original computer. I hope you've enjoyed today's video. Make sure you subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss a future episode. Let me know down in the comments what you're working on. And as always, be creative and build something awesome.